2017 with friends, family members and celebrations. One family in the East welcomed the new year in the hospital, but for good reason. WNCT's Tamara Scott introduces us to Greenville's first baby of 2017. He was born at 119 and the first New Year's baby. Dominique Perkins Jr. made his appearance early this morning at Vita Medical Center. It's unforgettable. It's amazing. <laughs> and it's a blessing. Mom Ashley Marks says her original due date was December 30th, but Junior needed some extra time in the oven. Strong. Um, he smiles a lot. He has dimples. I'm already in love with him. <laughs> Marks says she never thought she would give birth to Greenville's first baby of the new year. I can't believe it. This can't be happening to me. <laughs> but I was ready. This isn't her first birth, but she says it was definitely a little different. It's an experience and it's unforgettable. It's a memorable moment and when it happened on a holiday, it's even, it's unforgettable. RN nurse Brandy Blanco says sometimes these moments bring more pressure on New Year's. Just when the baby's born, it's a lot going on, but it's even more exciting when it's a holiday and you know it's going to be the first New Year's baby. Mark says she wouldn't have wanted to spend the New Year in any other way. So we'll be bonding and we'll be partying together <laughs> every New Year's from here on out. She has some advice for future new moms. I wish them the best and it's, it'll be over before you know it, so enjoy it. Dominique Perkins Jr. wasn't the only New Year baby. At Carolina East in New Bern, a little boy, Owen Allen Register, made his arrival at 3.07 p.m., weighing in at 8 pounds and 3 ounces. In Greenville, Tamara Scott, 9 on your side.